Hey guys, today I'm playing some more Cities Skylines Mass Transit, and uh, well, I, I actually don't remember what we were doing last time. Oh yeah, West Poor People Town. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Make more poor people. And I got an airport last time, so I should install that at some point. But right now, we need business and shops and houses. We need everything. Um, surely if we need all of it, we don't really need any of it. Although I guess it's demand, it's what people want. Um, so yeah. I guess more farms, you know? We got we put a bit of farmage in, put some offices in probably if I've got more office space left. Um I've probably got places to book business still. I don't really don't really know. Uh yeah. Put a few more in there. Uh yeah, there's still a bit of office space. It's all kind of coming together now. I don't know where I want the office to exactly stop. Probably just on this road, because this is probably a bit much, really. Um, yeah, I think that'll just be the whole office district. I think that'll be nice and completed. This'll be something else, just because you don't want it all in one place. So, yeah. And then shops, we can just kind of put them in places. Have you... Oh, my God. Why is... How is a pool on fire? That doesn't make any sense. They burned to death at a... Sea parks. <laughs> Have you seen IT Crowd? Uh, I watched that episode recently, that's exactly what happened there. <laughs> Your parents burned to death out of sea parks during the Water Lion show. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, anyway, yeah, let's keep let's keep on keeping. If you haven't watched the IT Crowd, which is actually called the It Crowd. I don't know why it got its name changed to the IT Crowd, but it's it's the It Crowd because like that's the joke, because they're not the it crowd. They're not all it, because they're lame and, ugh, yeah. But, oh no, it's the IT crowd. It's like, yeah, it's a play on words, asshole. Um, that's one of the things that makes me very mad in life, um, <laughs> is people calling the it crowd the IT crowd. Um, although I think it is universally called the IT crowd now, so I should probably stop being such, uh, well, I knew what it was called before it was cool kind of person. Um, yeah, it looks like we have enough cemeteries and crematoriums. It's just people die in waves in this game. Because um, of. Cause they all live about the same amount of time, so they kind of just die in waves. Um, so. Yeah. There's not much to be done, really. They'll just slowly clean up the bodies. But for a while, it'll look like we got a lot of dead people. Anyway, where shall I put my airport? Maybe here. Or here. Oh, I don't have this bit of land. Because that'd be quite good. Maybe here? No. Huh. I don't know where I want to put it. I don't really want it over here. Um, but this is going to be nice city. But I guess that's sometimes where airports go. There's London City Airport. Oh, I don't know what I want to do now. Ah, where should I put the air? Well, let's find out where it can go. And then work from there. So, airport is here. Um, needs to be placed by a roadside. Yeah, so it can go here because it's all flat. So it can't go like here because the slope's too steep. Uh, it can go here, and that will be right next to poor people town. I mean, yeah, that would make sense to make them have to deal with the planes. Like maybe I'll put it at an airport here at some point. But I think my main airport's got to be out of the city. Like London City Airport is in the middle of the city, but it's tiny. So yeah, I might put it here. Or maybe, oh, I can't put it there because the slope's too steep, so it kind of has to go next to poor people town. Um. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it totally could. Alright, let's 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 figure that shit out. Alright, we're putting in an airport and it's going here. Which is probably, it's not really the edge of the city. Well, it kind of will be though. Like, this is going to be all industry over here and less dense. So I think this probably will be pretty much the edge of the city. Um, so yeah, all right, let's get let's get working. Um, and the great thing is it goes next to Poor People Town, which is just fantastic. I had a complaint and comment last time that I uh, used uh, default, like the built-in, um, like intersections too much. It's like I can build an intersection, but it'll look like this. It won't look nice. Like I downloaded these. I put work in. But yeah, apparently someone was very unhappy about that, um, which was like, oh, well, I don't care. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, we just use a small roundabout. Um, yeah, like that. But it will be motorway. So if we get rid of this, 
And then upgrade it to, uh, to, to motorway. Like that. And then link the motorway to it. Like, ooh. Oh. Like that? Fuck. Oh, yeah. That kind of works. Well, I'll just bring it in more. So there's less kind of curvage. Um, then I've got to flip the way. Like that. Uh, yeah, okay. No, that's no good. Yeah, that's alright. And then, the same here. Ooh, yeah, that really messes up how the roundabout looks, but... Well, whatever. Um, and then if we... Do... This? Oh, God, this roundabout looks... I should've used a bigger one. It looks horrible now, but who cares? Um, I'll take it here. Yeah. Ah, looks fine. Alright, and then I'll put the airport somewhere here. Um, I don't want to put it right on this road, because that would just be a bit... Yeah. Um, I'll, yeah, put it here. Alright, cool. Gonna get ourselves an airport, yo! Fuck. I underestimated how big airports are. Um, okay, well, I'll back that road up a touch. And... What do you put it there? Ah! I'll, I'll back the road up and I'll put it in here because I've got this nice little square dug out for it now. And I can put a few cool things around it. So, yeah, if I do this, like that, um, and put the airport there. Yeah, that works. That's alright. You've got to dodge a lot of roads to land. Oh, it made these people happy. Fuck! <laughs> Yeah, alright. Does that have power? Nope. Can I put a... Oh, I can. Oh, oh I can put a power line across a runway. Hmm. Uh, okay. I mean, I don't want to say that's a terrible idea. But that's a terrible fucking idea. It's like, oh yeah, when you land, just avoid all the roads. Don't fly through the power lines. Don't have too big a tailplane. Alright. Yeah, poor people time. They get to just look over, see the beautiful airport. Um, and here we need some shops, because you got to buy food on an airplane. you got to, in the airport, there'll be off licenses. You can buy hundreds of cigarettes for very cheap. Um, as, 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 actually I don't think things are even really cheap. Like, you're always like, oh, I'll go to the uh, duty free in the airport. Alcohol will be really cheap. But then it's just not. And it's like, oh, I've been lied to. I should have just bought it in the country. Um, yeah. Uh, when I went to Turkey, though, like, we got to the airport, like, way early. Because our flight was at, like, four in the morning, and we had to get a lift there from my girlfriend's uh, mother. So we had to get there at, like, 11 at night. And I think we were just sitting in the airport for, like, like, just, yeah, like, six hours or something stupid. Um, and, and the thing about an airport is that airport's really fun once you check in and get to the place with all the shops, but you can't do that until like a bit before your flight. So we had to wait in the bit outside for like six hours where there's like basically no chairs, all the stuff just shuts. And uh, yeah, it kind of sucked. <laughs> that was one of the longest, longest periods of my life. Of just sitting in that airport basically waiting room. Um, yeah. Anyway, maybe put some trees around, man. Put them all near the uh, near, near the fucking runway. It'll be great. Just dodge the trees on the way in. Oh, it's already got pine trees. Well, I will put more in. Trees. Ah, look at that. Beautiful. Makes it harder to break into the airport. Yeah, there's no security on this. You can just walk into the airport. I feel like there should be some fences or something. Like, I mean, I mean, come on. Um, yeah, we'll tree up this a bit as well. Yeah, it'll be surrounded with trees? Yeah, why not? That's a good idea. Okay, that's too many trees. Yeah, I don't like that. Okay. It's also just probably not a great idea to put that many trees around an airport. Um, <laughs> yeah, fuck it, I'm just gonna get rid of all these trees. Now there's no trees. Nothing. Fucking nothing. Maybe some little bushes, though. Yeah. All right. Um, up that. Put in some little little row bushes. Oh, that just looks kind of. Oh, that looks kind of cool. All these little ones. Yeah, I like that. 
Alright, yeah, that looks kind of cool. Yeah, there we go. That's nice. Alright, okay, I've got my airport now. All is good. But now we need more houses and places and things and. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so, yeah. God, I bet the noise pollution here is terrible. I haven't actually checked on noise pollution. Oh. Oh, they haven't got it too bad. Actually, probably worse to live here. But this is rough. It's okay here a little bit. But, oh, or here, yeah, it's because there's little shops and things there. Party Island, obviously, but, you know. Yeah, noise pollution's not great in this town. Do trees cut it off? I don't think they really do. You'd expect them to. Um, outside connections. Oil products. Yeah, most of our outside connections is oil. Apparently ore. I guess we import. Oh, that's what we import. Why the fuck are we importing oil? We're exporting oil, goods, and agricultural products. And tourism? Mostly medium wealth people. That's some good shit. We got some, uh... Got some people who aren't poor coming in. But also people who are... There's not a lot of rich people. But I guess there's just less, less rich people in the world. You know? Probably. Um, well, yeah, otherwise they wouldn't be rich, would they? Um, they'd just be people. Uh, okay, I'm gonna put in some more business. Try, try and busy up this road some more. Um, how many people do I need to get the final thing? I need another 13,000 people. Okay. Hopefully we'll get that soon, because I really want to get all the land. Someone actually tweeted a picture at me of, uh, they'd filled up all 25 squares with just, just buildings. It was like, fuck, dude, that's insane. Um, I don't think I'll do that, because, partly because I want it to have a little bit of interesting open space and stuff. Talking of which, I haven't been parking very well. As in, put in parks, places. Not parking my car. I don't have a car. Um, because I don't need one. Although, whenever I go home, I'm like, God, this would be so much more fun with a car. Because, like, I'm, I'm, I always, the trains are mad expensive now. Like, I got a train up to see my grandparents uh, recently, and it was like, 60 quid. I was like, fucking hell, this used to be like 20. So I have to get a coach home. And I can get the Megabus, which is the really sick coach. Which, uh, you know, takes me to a the one of the cities near where I live and then I have to get like a lift or a bus or something um, so that ends up being not much cheaper unless I can get a lift uh, and then or I can get the slightly more expensive one that does actually go right to my town which is really good um, but yeah that's always annoying because there's always screaming children someone always comes and sits next to me and I'm like ah, oh, just fuck off or worse I turn up late and have to sit next to someone because then it's like okay well this is terrible um, so yeah, I'm sitting there thinking, yeah, it'd be better if I had a car, then I could stop places. It'd be almost like a shit road trip, and yeah, um, so that's that's my thoughts on cars. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, it's because I said I wasn't parking very well. Um, yeah, I should probably put a crematorium in here because people are dying. Um, yeah, I should put it in here. Cool. All right, talking to uh, talking in cars. How's traffic? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. I don't think double roundabout really helped, you know? I mean, there's more road for sure, but I, I don't think people <laughs> really, I don't think it's helpful. It's also on a bit of a slant, so you like slip down. It's better than it was, but not enough to warrant the second roundabout. This worked more just better, because it was kind of the logical solution, like take the traffic away from the roundabout, because it's not, doesn't need to go on the roundabout. Um, so yeah, I'm very pleased with this. It is traffic-y, but that's just because there's a lot of stuff there. Uh, more people are starting to use this, which is good, but, yeah. Um, this is crazy busy. This should be a roundabout, but I have to move so much stuff. And I also don't think it would help. Like, roundabouts are sometimes helpful in very certain situations. Can I... Is there traffic lights to turn off here? I'm going to turn on some stop signs here because there's less people coming this way and yeah shit that's a lot of traffic fuck dude that goes 
way up. Yeah, we're going to turn on stop signs here so that we can, so that people have kind of priority going down this way. Because there's not much traffic in these little streets, but on the avenues there really are. Um, yeah, hopefully that'll help a little bit, but I mean, what I really need is just another big road like this, which I could put here now. Um, can't really fit a junction in though, because, yeah, because like, mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was thinking maybe I'd have another one of these avenues down here. Um, that'd be good. I should start working on that so that when I can unlock this, I can add another one of these. Because this is just too busy. Um, and it's probably a lot of people trying to get into here. Um, so yeah, that's what we'll do. Uh, hmm. Okay, so if I expand this down this way a little bit. Yeah, just throw it out that way. And then, fucking monorail tracks in the way. Um, yeah, and then just do this, really. I guess down to there for now. And then, up there for now. And I could probably off-ramp it a little bit and have like a very janky intersection for now. Like it would look like hell, but it would probably be better than nothing. Because I bet a lot of people are just coming in and yeah, getting backed up there. Um, no, I guess you look that as well. Oh fuck, yeah, there's a monorail track in the way though. Well, okay. We'll do that another time. Um, yeah, this vertical road actually could probably just be served by being one of these. Maybe that's what I should do, but I'd have to move so much stuff. But that means this vertical road's just kind of really out of place. I might... D oh, I'll just delete it. Yeah. I, it just looks weird to have that vertical row when everything's horizontal except for the big roads. Kind of, it's almost a bit of a New York-y thing. Like, the avenues are big and the streets are small. Like, kind of almost what I'm going for, but not, like, all over, just in this one bit. I guess this is Manhattan, right? Um, although Manhattan's an island-ish. Um, yeah. Actually, I don't, won't link all of these roads. I'll link half of them, like that. So, get rid of this. Oh, well, I'm kind of going to need to link all of them, because I'm going to get rid of this vertical road. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, God, this, oh, this is just a really terrible bit of previous city planning, which has kind of fucked everything up. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to stick with this. I'm going to, um, yeah, I'm going to build this into a... I will leave some vertical road, but not too much. Um, and I've also got to sort out this monorail, because... I guess this should just be monorail road right here. Um, like, uh, where do you get, oh yeah, you get it from the monorail bit. Um, where's monorail? Train, metro, monor, tra oh it's here, okay. So if I make this monorail road, then hopefully I can just, boom, yeah, nice, that's all right. Then it even would, might let me extend the monorail. I haven't really done anything with the monorail for a while, but I may well need to, so, yeah. Alright. Okay, the experiment continues. I'm gonna leave that like that. Um. Okay, is that all of them? Okay, now let's get rid of the vertical road, because it just looks so out of place. Except in occasional places where it's needed. Um, or where it doesn't look jank as fuck need to move that. Also, this is probably destroying all of the bus routes. Although I haven't done bus routes in a while, which might help. Um, and I'm going to leave that bit. Okay. Right, let's get Swifty. Um, <laughs> that there. How are the districts? Need to be extended a little bit. There we go. Back up there. Yeah, nice. That's looking better. It's looking more uniform. And I'll probably have another one over here. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, there are some fucked up bus routes. But only one, though. That is surprising to me. Right, and then we can just uh, put in the houses, fill this up. Some people are going to have to live right next to monorail, which is a good thing, because the monorail is the best. 
Uh, <laughs> oh no, this shouldn't be houses, this should be shops, which is good because I need more shops, so we'll do that. And oh god, everything's getting destroyed for no real reason. Oh yeah, there is a messed up bus route. Oh man, I don't know what to tell you about that. Just fucking get rid of it. Just delete the stops, just forget it ever happened. Just fuck up the whole bus route. I'll have to redo these sometime. I might not... I might actually do that, like, out of video. Like, before next episode, I might just totally fucking redo the whole bus route. Just for, like, two hours. Um... God, that's gonna suck. Oh. Might just need to... Oh, to, uh, <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, I might redo that, because it's just trash. And it's not fun to watch me complain about making bus routes. Like, there's a, <laughs> there's a limit to what I'll put you through. Um, so yeah. Anyway, hopefully this will help a little bit with traffic. Obviously I need to redo all the... Uh, thingy jigs Like... Probably turn off all the traffic lights. Just have people just kind of go crazy. Um, also, we're running out of water. Shit. Well, not running out of water. There just isn't water pipes here. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Very unsafe, but better. Um, yeah, gotta bring the water down. And then... I've got, I am going to link up that road a bit with the motorway. Just like, you know. Just a little bit. Um, oh. There we go. Okay. Alright. And then off ramp. So, mm, no way to make this look good. And it, well, I will change it when I unlock this bit. So this looked like hell for a while. Um, but... So yeah, so if you go, maybe if this one goes directly there and directly out, can you do that? I'll just move this Zen Garden um, to here, perfect. Uh, yeah. Can I, oh come on, come on baby. Maybe I'll just do that, yeah there we go. <laughs> Jank as fuck, but that's kind of what I'm going for. Um, then we need to free draw uh, that. There we go. And then I also need to somehow get out uh, that way. This is going to be some mad bridge skills, and I'm. It's going to look really bad, but it's going to be fantastic. Um, there we go. Can I back that up to there? And then up some more? Up a little more? Oh, I had I had it. It was blue for a brief period. There is a way to do this. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Up. Or, or just under. And then up again. Yeah, maybe around it. <laughs> oh, this is going to look rough. Yeah, I'm going to have it on the ground go under this bridge and then up <laughs> and then over and down fuck yeah look at that intersection <laughs> oh that looks as bad as it possibly could and I, I fucking love it okay I might not even replace that okay okay it's over there we go, cool. Alright. Yeah, this is all a bit fucked, but it'll slowly fix itself. Um, how's the farm doing? We all go? We got workers? We got workers! Fuck yeah, dog. Uh, we'll put in some more then. Some more stuff. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be fucking great. Um, yeah, looking goo. Looking goo. Kind of need more houses. Um, I guess I could... F oh, yeah, we got planes. I haven't been keeping check on this. 50 passengers, yo! How is our tourism business doing now, do you suppose? Let's find out. Where's the outside connections button? 
Um, what does this do? Oh! I have 35,000 people employed, 36,000 jobs available, and we, only have, we have an unemployment rate of 3%. That's not bad at all, that's perfect. And we have a good population. Um, how do I, where's outside connections? Why can't I find this? What, oh, it's here. Uh, tourism. Less than usual. Okay. Yeah. We export more than we import. Fuck yeah, bro. We're kicking ass. We're great. I might move that power line. I want to see someone trying to land in the power line. Bring a plane in. Oh, this guy's coming in. Oh, here we go. And tears down the power line. They have no power. Poor people screaming out at the burning plane filled with 54 people. Not bad, though. Because there's a good amount of people having a plane. And here comes another one with another 47 people. That's pe people and people. We need a way out of here on public transport. Uh, I'm going to extend the subway. Maybe throw in a bus, but as I said, I might just totally redo my buses off the video. Um, because I think yeah, that's best. You know, it doesn't lend itself to a good video. Um, you know what? No, I'm. Did I add a stop and delete a stop? Well, fuck it. Um, I'm gonna have a separate line just for this. Uh, because I don't want to be distracting everyone all the time with this. 24 passengers. Bring more people. Surely it's not profitable to fly a plane with just 24 passengers. Uh, ooh, we're running out of trash capabilities. Um, well, I could put some over here, really. I mean, we've got all this kind of shit land that we're not really doing anything with. Well, actually, it's not. It's actually full of resources. It's not shit land at all, but this land I'm not really doing much with. So, yeah, it'll get a bit industrial, I think. I think this is where the industry is going to start up again. Um, yeah, you've got an industrial strip, this whole place. This is going to be industrial, I reckon. Yeah. Might start a wood wood cutting bit somewhere. Um, actually, I probably should start working on the ore mining section of the city, which is going to be over here somewhere, because there's ore. And we need more industry. And we've got loads of ore. So, yeah. Fucking get on it. Get on it like a car bonnet. Um, <laughs> cool. Yeah, fuck it. Let's let's start working on that. Um, I mean, yeah, we could have a motorway intersection, and I mean, there's a train right there. This would be the p perfect place. Uh, there's no traffic here right now, so yeah. I mean, it will take. A, I will need to expand the city a bit because uh, yeah, no one's going to actually work there until I like have an easy way to get there. But actually, no. I mean, because it can start down here. I mean. Yeah, it can start around here, so it'll be close-ish to the city. We've got Poor People Town right there. West Poor People Town, at least. Don't know what East Poor People Town's doing anymore. Walking to work, I hope. Yeah, look at that. Oh, this is a really busy footpath and bike path. There's a bike path right here for that exact purpose. Don't ride your bikes on the footpaths. I, I guess you can do that, though. See, these people get all kinds of exercise. I'm very nice to Poor People Town. I'm thinking about... They're the greater good for them. You know, I have only their best long-term interests at heart. Uh, yeah, that's that's the truth. Um, all right, so if we kind of do this like so. Uh, ooh, shit. Oh fuck. Yeah, do that, and then this is all. Mining. Maybe just, yeah. Oh, fucking back place. Um, telling me stuff. Uh, might as well expand it down a little more just so I don't accidentally put in normal industry because we don't want any of that shit. Uh, and then, yeah, let's start pulling ore out of the ground, yo. Um, where are the resources? Can I uh, start here -ish, I guess? Yeah, alright. Just, just throw a bit in, see what happens. Maybe put a uh, underground line here. Um, yeah, there we go. Tunnel it up. Extend that. And we're going to have ore, maybe. I'll just leave that. I don't expect it to do 
well. Oh yeah, you need water and power. Right, oh hey, it's already starting. That is better than I thought it would do. Um, but yeah, everything will need water and power. We're running out of water as well. Um, that's not fantastic. Oh, <laughs> patching that up in a horrible looking way. Uh, gonna get more of that. And then extend it even more because I'm gonna probably fill this whole place with industry. Um, and then we're also, yes, we'll need power. Uh, there we go. Cool. It'll be good. Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this person says it's a great city. Think I'm dreaming. Yeah, you are. It's a fucking great city. Best city. Fucking Canville. That's where it's at. Oh, someone said recycling. Ugh. Do I encourage recycling? Yeah, I do. I do. Good, good. Educational limps. Do we have free public transport? I should. Oh, I do. Okay. That probably cost me money, but I'm making loads. It's cool. We got seven million funds. Yeah, money stops being an issue after a while in City Skylines. Which is, yeah, it's kind of good, but also like, eh, I don't know. Feels a bit like it kind of should be something you should have to worry about, but I guess it's hard to do that. Not enough workers. You're right next to East Poor People Town. Just go in there with the net. Jesus, dude. <laughs> oh. I think this has helped a bit. I think the traffic, while is still quite bad here, is probably better because of this. Because, yeah. Um, actually, if I just extend that the whole way down, this is the avenue, right? Well, I'll just road, normal road it. But, yeah, we could have a, I guess, a bridge junction. Yeah, why wouldn't that work in real life? Why not? <laughs> oh Jesus, that looks jank as fuck, but I kind of enjoy it. Um, yeah, and that'll that really that really brings the whole thing together, actually. I think. Um, yeah, this is perfect. That is the best intersection ever made. Um, someone will probably tell me in the comments that it looks terrible, but yes, I know because there's no space to put a real intersection. Uh, haven't really completed the suburbs. Put some more shops in, I guess. Um, like that. There's probably too many. I probably need some more houses as well. And then there's... Oh, no, there's still loads of suburbs to fill in. Yeah, I guess I really should probably try harder with the suburbs. I kind of stopped a couple of episodes ago. Because I finished the roads and we're like, well, that's done. But no, it's just empty roads, mostly. Um, I, I do like how they look, though. I like... Yeah, I, I'm in, I very much do like this city. Like, a lot of my cities I end up kind of hating. But, uh... Because they just kind of look weird. But, yeah, this is good. Um, ooh. This is busy. Let's turn this into... Bigger road. That'll solve all the world's problems. Yeah! I just destroyed something. Doesn't matter. Okay, yeah. There's st still... Still a lot of issues here. Lot of oil trucks. Lot of oil trucks. Probably this shouldn't be uh, bus lane road. It should just be road road. Because, I mean, people have just got to get out of here in their trucks. No one's riding the bus. I mean, there are buses for sure, but they're not the issue. The issue is the oil trucks, yo! Wow, we must have made a lot of money off this oil. I'd like to know how much. Um, is there a way to find out how much money I've made off this? Um, there's also not enough buyers, but I, I can just build another oil plant. It's cool, we don't need buyers. This is just so useful to me, just to employ probably like, just, just thousands of people that, um, and it's most of my exports that I don't even care if there's not enough buyers. We'll just build oil plants because it's profitable for me just to build, just to make it, just to make it. Because it's like my, probably one of my biggest, yeah, probably, I don't know, it's actually probably equal to this. But yeah, it's just such a useful part of my industry that I, uh, I don't care if there's not enough buyers. Just keep making the oil. I mean, digging the oil. Well, you gotta kind of make it out of the crude oil. I doubt they're just shipping crude oil, are they? Who knows? 
Um, and yeah, now we're going to mine some ore. It's going to be great. You got workers? I mean, you got some workers. You got most of them. Um, yeah, maybe we should just put in some more poor people town. That'd probably help. Because then we'll have more workers for for mining ore. Go work in the mines. It'll be great, man. The mines are the best place to work. Nothing ever bad happens. There's a weird smell coming from the apartment next door. What does a dead person smell like? Probably like whatever you're smelling. Um, <laughs> uh, talking about weird stuff like that. I was watching the Great British, the new Great British Bake Off because my girlfriend wanted to watch it, and I put up little protest because why not? It has Noel Fielding in it, and, uh, <laughs> and there's this bit where Noel Fielding eats one of the cakes, and he's like, "Tastes like a clown's nose," and I was like, "How do you know what a clown's nose tastes like?" Jesus, dude. Uh, <laughs> oh, Noel Fielding. Um. How, is this helping tourism? Are we getting more tourists? How do I find this out? Tour, tour, where's the tourist button? Tourism? Oh, it's outside connections, right, which is this. Um, oh, there are a few more. Three, yeah, it's going up. And there's more high wealth people, because they'll fly in, because they ain't bitches. Um, I should also probably put in a train station for them to arrive in. Um, I could put it here. Yeah, just throw it here. It's near the tracks. Why not? Uh, I probably should have done that. Already. Planes, trains, and automobiles. Cargo terminal. Train station. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's slightly out of the way. It's on a main road. It's all good. Um, is there any public transport near it? If it's not, if it's buses, I'll do it another time. Because we have our buses are just all screwed, so... Uh, yeah, I mean, there's a, one of these. You know what, I'll make this a circle line. Add a stop here. There we go, circular line. Fantastic. Yeah, okay, and then this needs power. Wabam! Awesome. What the shit is this? Oh, these are incinerators, right. Oh, I just realized I, I, I didn't actually fix that water thing. We need more water. Um, so we're going to put this here. I'll put a couple in. A couple pumps. And we'll put a couple treatment things right here. Yeah, they still pollute a bit, but I guess it's less. So that's fine. Um, and then we need more shops, more industry, more everything. That is how the game go. Uh, there we go. Um, more industry. There we go. Actually, I should probably start side streeting this, but this is more of a test more than anything else. Um, hmm. I mean, if I really wanted to emulate uh, systemic disenfranchisement, maybe I should make recreational use illegal here, so like there's more stop and search, because that's like a big thing. Obviously in my world this is just general poor people, it's not a race thing, but in real life it kind of is a race thing, the whole stop and search thing. But uh, you're actually more likely to find drugs on white people, uh, but more black people get stopped in America because of that. Not getting political, that's just like a, it's just a fact um, that I was thinking of because I saw the recreational use, I was like, well if I really want to emulate this, maybe I should <laughs> emulate stop and search, but I feel like it's okay as it is and you know. <laughs> Then it gets a little bit too much like I'm emulating some awful things that happen in real life, not just making a general point. Anyway, though, um, on that note of, uh, of oh, just, just, just how dicey the world is, um, <laughs> I think I'm going to call it an episode. It's been like 40 minutes. We've done, we've, we've, we've progressed a lot. We got a, fuck you, don't you have power? I put a thing in. Apparently I didn't. Oh, there we go. Um, yeah, so power, awesome. Yeah, so we put in trains, planes, automobiles, more industry. Expanded everything. And, oh, yeah, and we actually made the roads better. Actually, yeah, I think we did. This does look less busy. It's less backed up. Not here, it's still backed up down here, but... Yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, okay, I can see why traffic lights would be helpful here. Yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we need traffic lights here. Sometimes turning off traffic lights helps. Clearly, it does not do that here. Um, so we're going to turn traffic lights back on here. 
sometimes it's helpful just to not have people stopping for no reason, but sometimes this happens. Just like actual gridlock. Oh wow, I didn't, yeah, I just never saw that. Yeah, we definitely do need traffic lights. It's going to take so long for that to filter through, though. Um, when you take traffic lights off a road, do they actually disappear from the... Oh, they do. Cool. Yeah, this should slowly stop being so ridiculous. Um, yeah, let's watch this for a bit and see if it... Fucking traffic light properly, dick. I put traffic lights there for a reason. Yeah, traffic... Wow, this is terrible. Fucking stop doing this and wait at the traffic lights. That's a red light, dick. Okay, it's slowly getting better, but not really. It's still a, just a horrible mess. And the traffic is backed up again. Uh, maybe it was better before. Uh, I want to see if this actually works out or if everything's always a mess. Just wait for the traffic lights. It's because... Um, there's stuff already in the intersection, and it'll take a while for it to get to the point where things aren't getting stuck, then the lights are changing. Um, yeah. And maybe that'll always just be a thing, because now the traffic's awful. It was way better before. But it looks like it's slowly sorting itself out. Not really. I think everything's just too backed up. I think it was better without traffic lights. It was better when it was a free-for-all. I'll, I'll look into that more next episode, though. So, yeah. Like I said, I hope you have enjoyed this. This has been episode 25? No, episode 15? I run t way too many series. I think episode 15 of City Skylines Mass Transit. I'll see you next time.